Okay, so Toyota 2TC and 3TC flywheels. They're traditional, they're metal. They're actually two types that I've seen. This type, solid back, very heavy. This type, which I think might be more common, they actually have a lot less metal in the casting right there. I'm currently swapping to a W58 transmission in my TE72. And as part of that, I'm gonna use this Fidanza aluminum flywheel with a Toyota truck clutch, because that will work with the input shaft on the W58. That's kind of a side tangent, but I wanted to show the difference in weights between the two styles of factory flywheel and aluminum. Because having a lighter flywheel on your engine will help it make more horsepower. I'm going to dyno this engine again after installing this aluminum flywheel. So first up, the heaviest factory Toyota flywheel. I've been running this one since 2020. And it weighs almost 23 pounds. 22 pounds, 14 ounces. Fairly hefty. Got nothing on a Chevy truck flywheel or something. Here's the lighter one with less material in the back from the factory. That one is two pounds heavier, two pounds, four ounces heavier, 21 pounds, 10 ounces. So we can see that if you're looking at and comparing stock flywheels, this one's just a little bit more desirable, but there probably won't be a seat of the pants noticeable difference. But now the Fidanza, I hope I'm saying that right, aluminum, this one, nine pounds, six ounces. That's gonna be almost 14 full pounds lighter than the heavy factory flywheel and 12 pounds lighter than the lighter factory flywheel. That should be pretty cool. More on this later.